2014 to spend 2% of their GDP on defense. And the U.S. actually agreed to spend at least 3% of its GDP on defense. And right now, it's at about 3.7%, which is over $600 billion. Of course, since the U.S. has a much larger GDP than any of the other countries in NATO, it's going to spend a lot more. And so this agreement was made before President Trump became president. But he certainly pushed a lot to have them actually live up to that agreement. And we actually just heard this week that Germany is not going to be living up to that. Uh, we already knew that they weren't going to be meeting the 2%. They had then set a goal of 1.5% of GDP on defense spending. And they actually reported this week they're not even going to meet that. So as uh, President Trump and Jens Stoltenberg of NATO today said in Washington, uh, they're doing better. Uh, they've got, and by getting countries to spend more, uh, Jens Stoltenberg says that they actually have an additional 100 billion that is being spent on defense thanks to President Trump's push, but they still have some work to do, that's for certain.